Welcome to Life with David. I'm David, and today I have to replace the air handler blower relay for my heat pump. It's been acting a little flaky recently, so I ordered a replacement that just arrived. This happened before, so this time I will replace it before it completely fails. So why don't you join me as we replace the model RLY2807 air handler blower relay for my train heat pump. I'd like to spend a moment on safety. There's nothing more important than keeping you and your loved ones safe. Be sure to read, understand, and follow the safety rules for your tools. Using your tools properly will greatly reduce the risk of personal injury, and always use the appropriate eye, hearing, and respiratory personal protective equipment. In this video, we'll be working with 240 volt line voltages. These voltages can severely hurt or kill you if you don't know what you're doing. If you're not comfortable working around these voltages, then don't. If you're following along, then you're doing so at your own risk. Now let's get started. This heat pump is about 15 years old. When it was about five years old, the operation of the air handler blower got a little erratic. The blower wouldn't always turn on, or it would run for a couple seconds and then shut off even though the outside unit was still in operation. I traced the problem back to a failing air handling blower relay, which I replaced. Problem solved. What does the air handler blower relay do? When the thermostat calls for heating or cooling, the outdoor unit, which includes the compressor and fan, immediately starts up. To limit the inrush current, the air handler relay delays starting the indoor air handler blower for two seconds until the outdoor compressor has started. Then it energizes the indoor blower. When the desired temperature has been reached, the thermostat immediately shuts off the outdoor compressor and fan. However, there is still a temperature differential between the indoor air and the refrigerant coil in the air handler. In order to capture all the energy left in the coil, the air handler blower relay keeps the indoor blower running for another 80 seconds. Then the relay de-energizes the indoor blower. This helps improve the efficiency of the heat pump system. Fast forward to today and I noticed some erratic operation again. Recently I came home and found the outdoor compressor and fan running, but the indoor blower was not. I also noticed a couple times that the blower would start and run for a few seconds and then turn off. 99% of the time it ran fine, but I couldn't predict when it would fail. So I decided to replace the relay again to avoid any problems I might see during the middle of a hot spell. My wife hates hot weather, and if the air conditioning fails, she melts down quicker than ice cream left on a stove. I ordered this relay from Amazon, and it arrived in less than a week. The relay is an exact replacement for the one in the air handler, so replacement should be easy. First, before you touch anything, turn off all the power to the heat pump system. In my case, this involves three separate breakers. Then open the air handler service panel. After the service panel is opened up, find the control box that contains the relay. In my unit, it's the box with the schematic on the cover. Remove the cover of the box and locate the relay. I find it is easier to remove the old relay from the control box with the wires intact, mount the new relay, and then transfer the wires one at a time from the old relay to the new one. This reduces the chance of error. After the wires are transferred over, route the wires so they don't get pinched by the control box cover. Then replace the cover. Okay. 
At this point, I turn the breakers back on and test the system. At the thermostat, I turn the blowers on and listen for it to start. It does two seconds after receiving the start signal. So far, so good. Next, I turn the blower off. It continues to run, finally shutting off about 80 seconds after I turned it off. Success. Finally, I put the service panel back on and then I'm done. Thanks for joining me today. We replaced the air handler blower relay for my heat pump system. I expect this will last for another 10 years before it starts acting erratically again. By that time, the heat pump will be 25 years old and I may just replace the whole thing. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If not, give it a thumbs down and leave a comment or suggestion for things to do. I hope to do more of these videos, so please subscribe and click on the bell for notifications of new videos. Let's get together next time for another day in Life with David. See you soon.